Hai Assalamualaikum and also salam sejahtera So in 1955 we lost the greatest scientist in the world which is we call it Albert Einstein He died in April 1955 due to abdominal aorta aneurysm So right after his death his brain was uh, removed Uh, by a pathologist called as Thomas Harvey and Thomas Harvey also uh, put Albert Einstein brain in a solution we call it as formalin and after that he dissect Albert Einstein brain into 240 blocks then every tissue sample from the each of the 240 blocks uh, mounted on a microscope slide Then he distribute the slide to the world best neuropathologist. Then what he discovered was compared to our brain, our normal brain, two part of Albert Einstein brain have a lot of glial cell. So uh, what all we call it as or what we know as a uh, neuron, and Albert Einstein brain also lack of furo. At the parietal lobe, so this is indicated related to his ability in three-dimensional thinking and also his ability in mathematical skill. Then, uh, the scientists also uh, analyze uh, original photo of Albert Einstein brain and also compare to our normal brain. And what they observe is and what they um, they discovered was. His prefrontal cortex different from us. His prefrontal cortex had an unusually complex pattern, which is important uh, for his abstract thinking. That's all for me. Thank you.